Hi, this is Zach from Fish on Fishing, and I'm here to give you the fishing tip of uh, the week of February 18th. And today's fishing tip is going to be about ice fishing, uh, specifically about uh, jigging for panfish. Now, um, when jigging for panfish, you're going to want to use a light uh, jig rod with some very uh, light line. Now, I prefer anywhere from 2 to 6 pound test. Here I have a fray bill that I think has four pound test on it. Um, there you can see it. And uh, what I like to use is a small jig. So I tie the small jig here to um, my main line. And a lot of guys like to use a split shot, but I don't. I just keep my main line there. And uh, on that jig, the little thing, you can uh, attach uh, a live bait like a uh, a small, um, I like to use, uh, my favorite bait is spikes, hands down, but, uh, shiners, night crawlers, um, wax worms, mealworms, just about any little worm or small little fish will work, and, uh, basically the smaller the bait, the smaller the fish will be most of the time, uh, the smaller spikes and mousies and such will catch you the sunfish and the golden pond shiners and such. Whereas the shiners will catch you the big crappie and the perch and the smaller bass. So basically what you're going to want to do is go out and get yourself a small jig rod and a pack of small jigs and a little bit of bait. Get out there on the ice and dr now you have your baited jig. And you're going to drop your baited jig down about a foot off the bottom and hold the line. See, I, I'm holding the line right above the reel. That way, when a fish hits, I'll be able to feel it, uh, feel the bite uh, through the sensitivity of the line, rather than waiting to see my rod tip move around like this. So, really what you're going to want to do is fish your bait about a foot to three feet off the bottom, and you should have a lot of fun catching a lot of panfish. Uh, thanks for watching. Until next time, uh, I'm Zach from Fish on Fishing. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks, guys.